I've now closed Servoy and I'm ready to begin. To connect to another database in Servoy, you must have a JDBC driver for that database. For today, I'm going to connect to a MySQL database, and I already have a driver for that database available. Once you have your driver, you need to open the folder where you've installed Servoy. There's a folder within the main folder called Application Server. We open that, and we open the Drivers folder. Here you'll find all the JDBC drivers available to Servoy. I'm going to go ahead and select my MySQL driver and place it into this folder. Now we can restart Servoy. Once your Servoy developer is open, we now have to connect to this database. You notice we have a node called Database Servers. This has all the servers that are connected to our Servoy installation. Let's right click on Database Servers, select New Server, and we can also select the type of server we want. We want a MySQL server, so we click OK. A new window opens that allows us to set up a connection to the server. Go ahead and use the root password, and I need to rename it. Now once we click save, it will do a test connection. Ah, it wants to know what database I want to connect to. So we'll connect to test. Once hit save, once I've hit save, if it comes back with no errors, it has already made a test connection and it is connected to the database. So we're finished here, we'll hit close. Now let's see if we can use our new database connection. To right click in our test solution and create a new form. We want to call this form customer and now we will select our new database. Now on example data we will use our test to customer referrals. I click next and it shows me the data available from our database. I'll go ahead and select all these fields and click finish. Now we have our new form from our new database connection. I can click to show in Smart Client. And now we see we have data from our new database connection filling in. Well, this is all I have for you today on this tutorial, Getting Started in Servoy 4. I hope you enjoyed it, and thanks for watching.